Hello, insufferable gaming fans. We're back again and we're making very rapid progress, though I'm by no means certain as to the direction that I need to be going. Let's see if we can get there from here. Alright. We got several ways we- Oh, this guy. This guy would be Batman if the Zelda games had bats, but they do not. They have Keese. So this is Keese Man. And the way we beat this fella is we have to kill all the Keese he summons in one go. Without missing any. Like that. The first time I ever fought this guy, it took me forever because I kept missing his bats. But if you beat all of them that he summons and sends at you in one shot, he's done. He's just totally done. Okay, should be some sort of thing in here. You know what? Let's get rid of these fuzzies with our handy dandy boomerang ring. That makes things a bit easier. Yeah. We're already on the nightmare key. Just for good measure, we'll smack that thing. I'm not sure if we need it. Let's hop down here, see what's there. Eh, nothing useful. We still need to get over yonder. And I still don't remember how to do that. Right offhand. We'll eventually get there. Oh yes. It's a mere matter of time. Out of time? Little time? Who knows? But, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. For those of you playing along... Yeah, okay, I got nothing. Just, uh, just trust me on this one. Not a whole lot interesting to say at this point. Um, I suppose we could check the old slab. We haven't done that yet, and take a drink. Oh, that's right, I haven't found the slab during this one. And since I forgot to uh, hit that switch, we gotta go all the way back. Be quick. We will be crushed and mangled. Shortcut. Not a very good shortcut. And one that ultimately probably won't work. At this late stage in the game, the rock's feather is your friend. Even more so than the shield, I'd say. Ah, here's a place we haven't been yet. Let's start hitting rooms that we haven't been to. Ah, this guy! Stay away! Ah, son of a bitch. I had him. You all saw me. I had him. Again, the boomerang will really expedite the uh, the fight if you don't screw it up and wind up in a, in a pit. You see what that guy's doing? You see it? You, you, you see what his game plan is? He knows he can't beat me in a straight-up fight, so he's knocking me down a pit and resetting his hit points, the clever bastard. It's a classic gamer strategy, and I don't expect NPCs to be using it. Haha. -ha. Alright. If I recall correctly, we have to get those guys matched up. We have to. 
but we can't do it from this side. We have to go over there and then hit him. And that is very much easier said than done. Okay. There's a wall up there that is bombable. We need to take note of that and bomb the other side of it because I don't believe there's a hint on the other wall up there. We just have to take a note on the map of where we need to bomb through and then get there. Looks like we've already been there. Uh-oh. Flying tiles. Well, we're off to a cracker jack start with these bad boys. They can be hopped. Actually, I never noticed that before just now. Now we're talking. Now we are talking. First things first, let's take out this column. Now, we just got this one down here, I believe. This next one is going to be a bit of a pain. And by a bit, I mean a lot. It's going to be a lot of a pain. It's like Mighty Samson said to the Bible Inquirer, whenever I see a column, I just push it aside. Oh, -ho, that was horrible. Some 1980s Mad Magazine humor right there. Oh, well, when I push that block up, I set that one to club, so we've got to get him all there. Now all we've got to do is wait for that guy to come over here and get the club. And the reason? So that we can grab that with the hook shot and get over there. But first, we've got to make sure we don't drop this ball down that pit. Oh, wait a minute. Never mind. We can't do that from here. We gotta throw it from the other side. Oh, yeah, we gotta... I'm going to point to my sword, or point with my sword. That area over there, we gotta bring the ball back around to it, throw it up here, and then hook shot across from here, and hit that. Sounds easy enough, right? Well... Luckily, I didn't screw that up too badly. I have a vague idea of what's going on. Let's take a shortcut. Whee! We need the bracelet and the feather. Quick jump from here. And we're on our way. Toss the Toss the, toss the ball over. Yeah, we just got to get it to that room down below. And after that, everything should be smooth sailing. I don't think I need to put it over there. Maybe be wrong. We'll find out. We'll find out very soon indeed. Okay, got to take the ball through the right side of this room and to the left. Pick up a heart while we're at it. See, this isn't so bad, is it? The answer, of course, is yes, it is so bad. Because now... We would normally have to do a bunch of convoluted crap to get over there from here. Luckily, I has a boomerang. I believe I also picked up... Yep, I picked up a key on the way. So, now I can go over here. A quick hop and a quick step. Now I just throw that. And the only thing I have left now is to go back around, and it's smooth sailing. Well, naturally we've got to deal with these joker tiles again. I'm not even sure they're hitting Link, I think they're just getting near him and exploding to prove a point. <laughs> Ooh, 
hook shot across. And the grab grab of the thing. And blammo. That done, the tower will fall. The tower will fall and the Crimson King has his day. If you get that reference, good for you. That was completely unnecessary. Well, I think with the next video we'll be able to fight the boss. So until then, this is Rosser once more, and take a drink.